Why does David Lynch, the master of the odd and surreal, hate his own adaptation of Dune? Let's dive into a cinematic sandstorm and uncover the gritty details behind one of sci-fi's most infamous adaptations. Buckle up, because this journey is more twisted than a spice-induced vision. In 1984, David Lynch embarked on a quest to adapt Frank Herbert's epic Dune, a novel as vast and complex as the desert planet of Arrakis itself. With a rich mythology and a fanbase as dedicated as the Freeman, the pressure was on. But unlike Denis Villeneuve's acclaimed 2021 adaptation, Lynch's Dune turned into a box office worm, burrowing into the sands of cinematic flops. Lynch, known for his surreal storytelling was an unconventional choice for Dune. His previous works like Eraserhead and the Elephant Man showcased his unique vision, but Dune required a balance of mainstream appeal and the novel's intricate lore. Despite his initial excitement, Lynch's journey into Herbert's universe was fraught with studio clashes and compromises that diluted his vision. The production of Dune was as challenging as navigating a sandstorm. Lynch's attempt to bring his surreal flair to the sci-fi epic clashed with Universal Pictures' desire for a more conventional blockbuster. The version of Dune that hit theaters was a hackneyed combination of Lynch's version and studio-mandated scenes that didn't reflect what either party wanted. It was a situation similar to the controversy surrounding 2017's Justice League and the conflicting styles of Joss Whedon and Zack Snyder, disappointing fans and critics alike, leaving the director to lament his loss of creative control and disown the project. Despite its failure, Dune was a pivotal moment for Lynch, marking his first collaboration with Kyle MacLachlan and steering him away from his big studio projects, leading to masterpieces like Blue Velvet and Mulahan Drive. While Lynch has expressed no interest in revisiting his Dune or exploring Villeneuve's adaptation, the possibility of a director's cut remains a tantalizing what-if. Despite its troubled legacy, Lynch's Dune is a significant chapter in the director's career, highlighting the challenges of adapting beloved source material and the importance of creative freedom. So as we traverse the dunes of cinematic history, we're reminded that sometimes the most fascinating stories are the ones behind the camera.